Hello everyone, Beagle here. We've got an epidemic in the male celebrity world. I want to get to it. It's just, it's something I, you know, I was up last night and I'm thinking to myself, I mean, what, what can we do to help these people out? So not put themselves in this position, you know, let's start with Harvey Weinstein, Winston, whatever the damn name is. I don't even care. I didn't even know about the dude until a month ago when he's blowing up every news site and you know basically for two weeks every day you get something new he raped the girl he did this he's got a casting couch for women blah 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 dude sounds like he's he's got some issues all right i, I know what his main issue is we'll get to that at the end but let's let's just start with him so he's the first one that ends up in the celebrity ends up in the news doing all this stupid shit with women and everything like that and you go louis say louis ck and he, I, I never expect him he's a comedian you know i mean yeah they're into some fucked up shit you know, but still, I guess he thinks it's all right just to, you know, pull his dick out in front of women and, you know, masturbate. So, that dude's got his own issues. I don't know why anybody would want to see him do his thing anyway, so I don't know what he's thinking. But, I, again, I know what his issue is. And you got Kevin Spacey. This guy sounds like a diddler, all right? Has no problem messing around with underage men, all right? Then you got Terry Crews. Big, black, African-American dude. And he's saying how some producers or some higher-ups have groped him as a recently this dude is huge have you seen this dude i mean look at him there he is i'm gonna show him to you right now he's right there there he is dude's huge nobody's gonna be fucking messing around with this guy unless well you got the same problem as these executives do as louis ck uh, uh harvey and uh kevin spacey and then we go to matt lauer matt lauer got caught he's i've done he's got a button you just go under the desk traps a woman in there hey bitch you want out you know what you gotta do he's got that going on for him then he gives out you know gives out sexual toys for christmas or birthdays whatever it may be and he shows them how to well you know explanation how to use them he even went as far as reprimanding one of his uh co-workers because he pulled out his stuff and she didn't do nothing with it the nerve of this guy he thinks he can just oh yeah hey oh oh you're not doing oh, forget you i'm writing you up so so there's that guy then as of late, this is the one that in the in the gaming world, Twitch, the one that everybody's like, oh my god, oh my god, Doctor Disrespect comes out. He's been unfaithful to his wife, so he's gonna take some time off. Not cool, right? I mean that. I mean obviously it's not cool. It's it's, it's horrible for his family. It's horrible for his wife. The situation's not good at all. He looks. I mean he's crying all this shit. I mean this dude's been popular as anybody in the gaming world for the last, I don't know, year. He's getting just getting bigger and bigger and bigger. So that's the problem, guys. He's getting bigger and bigger and bigger. So I'm here to fix these issues for this this man, uh, Harvey, Louie, anybody out there. This is what you're going to do, all right? If nobody knows this already, my name's Roy, okay? Yeah, I know. I know it's a it's a beastie name. It's it's I'm a beast as in sexy beast. That's 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 just it. It's, it's not anything else other than be just sexy beast, all right? You know, Roy. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to start hashtag Give Roy your money, okay? No, 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 that doesn't, that doesn't sound good. Let's see, let's see. Let's, let's take another one. Hashtag. Hashtag. Mm. God, I got to think of this here. Let's think about this here for a minute. I can cut this shit out, so we're going to figure this out. Hashtag pay Roy. There you go. Hashtag pay Roy. That's simple. That's not that bad. Pay Roy. Hashtag pay Roy. So what we're going to do is, all you celebrities out there, I'm sure you're watching this too. I know you are. And, you know, all these other people that, you know, big wigs or whatever it might be, uh, you know, higher ups and companies, you know, that, you know, feel like the urgent that, you know, God, I really want to sleep with that woman. I really want to do this. I want to, I, you know, I really want to do that. Well, the problem is you need to get rid of the money. I mean, that's, this is the problem. I mean, this is what money is the cause of all these problems. If you guys don't have the money, you're not getting these women, first of all. Cause, I mean, look at Harvey. Look at this motherfucker. I mean, you got people like, I get it, Brad Pitt. I mean, you know, the dude's sexy. I mean, I get it. You got freaking Brad Pitt. You got, let's see, Tom Hardy, Leo. Um, let's throw Terry Crews out there again because I don't I don't want to sound racist. And, oh, oh, oh. Well, that's three white guys, one black guy. That still sounds kind of racist. So let's say, let's say I'm a big Washington Redskins fan. Let's say the whole Washington Redskins team, black athletes, they're all good-looking men, all right? We're going to say them. On every day, those those guys look really good, except for Sunday. They never look good on Sunday. I mean, I don't know. Monday, sometimes Thursday, sometimes Saturday, and anytime in the playoffs. 
because they're well, no, they look good in the playoffs because they're not there. So they're on their couch, they're chilling. So yeah, so we'll go with the Redskins team, Washington Redskins team, Terry Crews, Brad Pitt, Leonardo DiCaprio, Tom Hardy. So compare those guys to here we go, Harvey. Oh yeah, yeah, Harvey. Oh, Louis C.K. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, even Kevin Spacey for that matter. I mean, I mean Matt Lauer. I mean, he just looks like a penis. I mean, so you you. So how are you guys getting away with this shit for as long as you were? Well, it's simple. They got money. So, back to the point. That's what you're going to do. Give me your money, all right? I'm taking one for the team here. I want all your money, all right? Well, not all of it. I mean, you guys got to live still. But if you got too much money, you just give it to me. You go to Twitch TV, all right? You go to search it. I will have the link in the, in the page below. Don't worry, but I will have the link. Search Desert Beagle 85. That's me. You go to that page, you follow it, and then guess what? You can subscribe, and you can donate whatever money you want. And I'm taking one for the team. You ever seen that South Park where Kyle takes all South Park's debt? You know, he takes a bigger credit card, he takes all the debt so they can keep spending. I'm like Kyle. You know, I'm like the savior here, except I'm taking your money. I'm not going to take your debt, all right? So give me your money, and I'll be the one that takes all the, you know, the bullshit that, you know, Harvey, Dr. Disrespect. Not Kevin Spacey. I don't want his thing. Uh, I don't really want any of these guys' things, really, to be honest with you, when it comes to what they're doing. I mean, Harvey, I mean, fuck that guy. If he's raping women, he just, whatever. Point is, they got too much money. And people that have too much money out there, you get yourself in trouble. So I'm going to take one for the team. You give me your money. Then you won't have too much money. And then you won't get yourself in this trouble. And I, I'll be the savior. So hashtag pay Roy. Give me your money. And that's it. Have a great day, and by the way, hit the thumbs up, hit the sub, have a great day, peace.